This video will cover the Measurement Tool and Physical Properties Tool. Measurement and Physical Properties Tools can be used in parts, sheet metal parts, and assemblies. The Measurement Tool will provide a variety of data about the selected items, including lengths, angles, distances, and types of features. This tool is used not only in sketches, but also with 3D modeling features and assemblies. The Measurement Tool can be accessed in the following ways. You can press Ctrl and M on the keyboard. You can obtain it from the ribbon under the Viewing and Analysis tab. Or you may find it at the main menu under Tools and Measurement Tool, as well as from the Inspection Toolbar. Both the Tools and Toolbar menus are available simply by pressing the Alt key on your keyboard. Linear and Angle now select a line and the name will be populated in the dialog box. Since you only have a single item selected, many of the options will not be available. However, you can view the line number, starting and ending locations, and the length of the line. Click back again in the selected geometry text box and select on the angled line in the sketch. If the linear type is chosen, many of the values will be zero. This is because the lines are at an angle to each other and the distance option does not make sense. Switch the type to angular and you will see the angle between the lines and the total length of the lines. Pairs, chains, and from first. The pairs option is used for determining the distance between two sketch figures. Only two items can be populated in the text box at a single time. Chains will give you the cumulative path distance between a sequence of selected items. Multiple items can be selected. The From First option will give you the distance from a variety of points that relate back to the original selected item. Physical Properties Physical Properties displays information about an assembly file or part file. This information includes volume, mass, center of mass, and surface area. You can access the physical properties of an assembly or part by going to the main menu under Tools and then Physical Property, or you may access it through the Inspection Toolbar, or you can find it on the ribbon under the Viewing and Analysis tab. A typical dialog box is shown here. The information shown pertains to the cylinder head assembly shown a moment ago. It is important to realize that some of the values use engineering notation, which is represented by the letter E at the end of the number. In this video, you learned how to access and use the valuable measurement and physical properties tools. You are now familiar with the pairs, chains, and from first aspects of the measurement tool. You also learned that the physical properties tool can retrieve volume, mass, center of mass, and surface area information for parts and assemblies.